In this video, we will flash the firmware of an Atmel AT89S51 microcontroller using an Arduino Uno as an AVR ISP programmer. AT89S51 is an Atmel 8-bit microcontroller based on the Intel MCS-51 or 8051 for short, which was very popular in the 1980s for its low price, fast processing speed and largely available documentation. This microcontroller supports ISP, which stands for Insistent Programming, a method to program a microcontroller's flash memory using serial communication. According to the data sheet, port 1 is used for flash programming on pins 5, 6 and 7. Although the AT89S51 is not an AVR mic controller, it supports ISP flash programming, which makes it compatible with the AVR ISP Arduino Uno programmer that we built on the previous video. Place the microcontroller on the breadboard as indicated. Connect the Arduino's port 10 to the microcontroller's pin 9, Arduino's port 11 to the microcontroller's pin 6, Arduino's port 12 to the microcontroller's pin 7, and the Arduino's port 13 to the microcontroller's pin 8, as indicated in the pinout diagram. The AT89S51 is a fully static design, supporting external oscillators in the range of 0 to 33 MHz. For this pinout, we are using a 10 MHz crystal oscillator. Place it on the breadboard as indicated. Use two 27 picofaraday capacitors as indicated. According to the microcontroller's data sheet, 30 picofaradays are recommended, with a margin of error of 10 picofaradays. Now connect the input and the output of the crystal oscillator to the microcontrollers pins 18 and 19. Connect the capacitors to the ground pin 40 to the breadboard's 5 volt terminal. Connect Arduino's 5 volt and ground to the breadboard. Connect the microcontrollers pin 20 to the ground. Connect the microcontrollers pin 30 to high to enable the flash pulse programming. On macOS, install AVR Dude using Brew. The microcontroller's signature must be validated by this AVR Dude command. Make sure that the device signature corresponds to the AT89S51 info from the configuration file. The confirmation means that the AVR ISP programmer was able to successfully connect to the AT89S51 ISP interface. The second command sends the Intel X file through the Arduino programmer, writing the microcontroller's flash memory with the final firmware. As default, if not specified by dash D parameter, the microcontroller's flash memory is erased during the right operation. Now the AVR dude double checks the operation by reading the flash memory's content and comparing it with the X file. Remove the programmed microcontroller from the breadboard. It is ready to be tested. On the other breadboard, with the pinout as specified on the GitHub source code project, see comments section for the GitHub link. Place the 8089S51 chip. Power up the prototyping breadboard and wait for the code to start. As described in the GitHub project, this example uses an Itachi LCD module to display two simple 16 characters messages 
using the microcontroller's 16-bit internal timer.